This Falcon Wild Peak MT tire is for those of you that have a 1987 all the way up through the most current model year Wrangler that are looking for a nice, aggressive mud terrain tire. This is going to be available for wheel sizes from 15 to 20 and in tire sizes from 31 to 37. So you do have quite a few different options as far as sizing goes for this tire. Now, this is a mud terrain tire through and through. This is going to have big knobby lugs with some siping in between. It's going to have some nice space in between those lugs. That's going to allow the tire to clean out any mud or rocks that it might get in there to make sure that it keeps its tooth off road and it doesn't become completely caked in mud and just become a slick. It also has some tread down on the sidewall. It has a three ply sidewall. So all of these things are gonna make this tire very strong and perform very well in an off-road scenario. Now, when you do get this tire on-road, it's gonna be a little bit noisy. It's not gonna ride quite as comfortably and you're not going to get as much life out of it as you would an all-terrain or certainly a road tire, a highway style tire. So with tires, there's always a little bit of a trade-off. If you're spending most of your time off-road, I would recommend a good mud terrain, especially if you're in the mud a lot. If you are more of a weekend warrior, maybe once a month you hit the trail, maybe you wanna look at an all-terrain tire if you're using your Jeep as a daily driver the rest of the time. And if your Jeep never hits the street and you don't absolutely have to have this more aggressive look of a mud terrain, go with a highway tire that's going to wear better and be much more comfortable. So I already mentioned some of the construction features of this tire that make it a very good off-road tire. It has these very large lugs. They're gonna be great at giving you traction and gripping. The large lugs also have some siping in them. So especially when you air down this tire, even though it's a big, large hunk of rubber, it's gonna be able to flex in the middle and that allows it to contour to whatever you're driving over, giving you the maximum contact patch and the maximum amount of traction. This space in between here, again, is to clean out those tires. So when they do get caked with mud, you get a little wheel speed up, it's going to eject that mud, it's going to eject stones, um, which is going to keep this from becoming a slick, essentially, off-road and is going to keep that tooth. The tread on the sidewall here is going to allow you to really climb uh, rocks, stumps, other obstacles. Even with the side of the tire, you're gonna get great grip out of this tire. And it does have a three-ply sidewall, which is going to make it nice and strong and puncture resistant for you. So all of these things really make this a great off-road tire. As for installation, you're gonna wanna take this tire and your wheel to a mountain balance shop, have them put the tire on the wheel and balance everything out for you. Now, if you do have a large mud terrain tire, 35 and larger, sometimes the shop won't wanna balance it right away because a good amount of rubber does fly off of these things in that first 500 miles. So if they do ask you to bring your Jeep back in a few hundred miles, a thousand miles to balance it out, that's completely normal. That's something a lot of tire shops do. Now, if you have a three-piece wheel, if you have a beadlock style, you can mount these up in your driveway, but don't do what we've all seen on YouTube. Use some sort of combustible to mount up your tires. Leave that to the trail fixes. You'll wanna take the tires and have them properly mounted at a shop. The price of these tires is going to vary from $150 to $360, depending on the size of the tire and the size of the wheel it's designed to be mounted on. So of course, a larger tire is more expensive, there's more rubber there, that makes a lot of sense. But also, a tire designed for a larger wheel is gonna be more expensive than a tire designed for a smaller wheel. So the same 33-inch tire for a 15-inch wheel is going to be less expensive than one for a 20-inch wheel, and that's just kind of a general rule of thumb, that's just how tire pricing breaks down. Overall though, I think this is a very good, aggressive, off-road mud terrain tire. If that's what you're looking for, I think this is priced very fairly. So if you're looking for a good, aggressive mud terrain tire for off-road use, I would definitely recommend taking a look at this one from Falcon and you can find it right here at extremeterrain.com.